Hey guys, it's Megan and I'm here with Nick from My Mind's Eye and we're really excited because they have some fantastic different products that have come out with the CHA show and Nick is going to be talking to us about some of the beautiful things and designs that My Mind's Eye has released for us. So let's take a look. Some of these layouts here, this is from our Stell and Rose line. Um, some of the things that they're featuring here is layered chipboard. Um, I have some of it right here. You can check it out. Maybe Megan can hold it up for you. Um, our designer, she's used that here, as you can see, and it's something that's very popular. It's new to scrapbooking, um, the layered chipboard, but it's new to my mind's eye as well. Um, along with these layouts, you can see here, I'll show you in a minute, Lush 2. Lush 2, this is another popular line. Um, what our designers used here is some of the flocked paper. Like I was telling her, it reminds me of those corduroys my mom used to force me to wear. Um, and then we've got the other papers there. As always, we've got our brads that are very popular in every single line. Um, our lost and found line, those brads were very popular. And we've kind of carried that over to our Stell and Rose line. The designer from Lost and Found, Jen Allison, she also did this line. Um, another, another big point from these ones are the 6x6 six six pads. I was showing Megan those earlier. In the 6x6 six six pads, um, they are double-sided, and you get all the designs that you get with the regular paper, but you get two additional designs for each scheme as well. That's really awesome. I absolutely love... Nick had showed me a new ribbon pack that has a zipper design. It's pretty awesome, and it's featured up here. You guys can take a look at it. Um, I think that's really, really awesome. They've come out with some really cool things. Again, you can see those uh, layered chipboard stickers on there as well, and I really like a lot of these designs all the way around. There's also the Fine and Dandy, and what was the other collection that you'd saw? Lush 2 and Good Day Sunshine are the ones that came out. We had Fine and Dandy, which was our autumn release, and those two are just over on the other side. So okay, Let's go take a look. Okay, so now we're going to take a look at, okay, what's the name of the line this again? Sorry. Good Day Sunshine. Okay. So... Good Day Sunshine, this is our kind of our whimsical line to kind of even out the release. Um, Stell and Rose, the one I showed you earlier, along with Lush 2. Lush 2 is kind of a basic color line, and Stell and Rose is kind of a more vintage, shabby chic line. So Good Day Sunshine is more whimsical, um, more fun. You get nine papers up here with the boy theme as well down here. Here's the girl theme. Um, as well with that, we don't have really any embellishments, but we also have this accessory sheet for it. So it's just kind of a more whimsical, fun line. Yeah, I really like this, especially I have a boy and a girl at home. So these are awesome, just little packs that um, I really think are awesome and great retail price point as well. So wonderful, wonderful things coming out from my mind's eye. So thank you, Nick, for yeah. your time and showing us yeah. to us. And Hi everyone, it's Megan and I'm here at the Provocraft booth with the new Cricut Magazine. And this is Colby and he is going to be telling us all about the new Cricut Magazine. I'm very excited about it. This is a screenshot of the April-May issue and Colby's going to take over and tell us a little bit about it. Okay, my name is Colby. I'm from Northridge Publishing and we are the publishers of Cricut Magazine. Uh, just so everyone knows, this is the only Cricut Magazine that's available that is endorsed by Provocraft and Cricut. Um, it is going to be a bi-monthly publication for the first three issues, then we're going to go monthly. Uh, it's basically for everyone out there who owns a Cricut machine but doesn't know how to use it and what to do with it, and which is a lot of us out there. Um, I've talked to a lot of people that are like, I love my Cricut, but I just don't know what to make with it. So we have projects from card making, scrapbooking, basically anything you can do with your Cricut machine. It's not limited to just one thing. Um, and we're just excited about it. It's, it's going to really open up opportunities to make some really awesome things with your Cricut machines. So uh, you can subscribe to it for your personal subscription. We offer personal subscriptions. You can probably also find it at your local shops, uh, blogs, things like that, have information about it. So other than that, uh, it's just a great product. We're excited to have it. I'm really excited about it. I cannot wait to get all of my copies every month or bi-monthly for, for right now. <laughs> and um, what's the price point? What's the monthly subscription price point? You know, it's nice, actually, because the, the retail cost of the publication is $14.95 if you want to purchase an issue at your store. Uh, the nice thing is, though, is we offer subscriptions which get you a little bit better pricing, uh, roughly around probably about $5 per issue with a subscription. So you get a six-issue or a 12-issue subscription, and you really save a lot of money with it. That is great. Well, we thank you so much for your time, no and it's great to meet you. Thank you. Oh, I guess we'll <laughs> yeah, do the left-hand left left hand shake. <laughs> All right, thanks. Thank you. <laughs>